Welcome back to my channel. So as you can tell by the title today, I have a really exciting video to share with you all. And it is the unboxing of a Hobonichi dupe that I discovered on AliExpress. So I'm just going to go ahead and pull out the items. So I did buy... As I said, the like Hobonichi Weeks dupe, as well as a cover, um, just a clear cover. So we'll do that first. Right, okay, so this is just a clear cover um, that I just picked up from AliExpress. It is from, um, from, from Ethan, from Ethan. Enon from Ethanon. I uh, I think that's how you say it. Completely butchering it, no doubt. It's just this clear Hobonichi week style cover. Yeah, and that's just that's just that really. Nothing really too much to shout home about. But this is the main event of this video so i'm gonna open this up as you can see i haven't opened it i've really had to restrain myself and what i'm using this for is my weight loss uh planner um i'm sort of looking at hobonichi and i thought like how i am with like losing weight i'm very on and off throughout the year um i just thought there must be something else out there so I went looking on AliExpress and I think I may have found a fantastic dupe. So this is it here. Um, I'll leave a link to it down below. I can't... Oh, it's from Kin, Kinbo. Kinbo. I think that's how you say it. Again, I'm actually completely butchering it. <laughs> um, so you have this like little instructions it says um and it's just all in chinese japanese so it makes complete no sense to me at all uh, but i picked up this and it's in this beautiful lilac purple very very soft um cover and yeah and i thought that i would just show you a little flip through of this um, to see what we all think about here. So this is the front. It just says weekly um, here. If you can see that's just embossed there. And then as we open up, um, we've got these first two pages here. And yeah, just very soft paper, just very smooth. And then we've got the second lot of pages here. And then we have the calendar um, section. So you've got 2021, 2022, 2023. Now I have got a Hobonichi Weeks, which is right here. And I thought that maybe we'll maybe just do a little comparison. Why not? Um, so obviously mine is all decked out um, etc and all set up but we can kind of see the side by side of things um so yeah this is like the front page of the hobonichi and this is what basically the next two pages are so this one is actually blank as well and it obviously just has the hobonichi and then here are the calendars so this is the hobonichi and this is the Duke. this is the king ball one so as you can see very similar um in regards to paper the uh, is it, am i right in saying that the hobonichi is the tom river paper i think that's how it's called i don't really know um <laughs> I'm, I'm just more like is this planner gonna work for me um but as you can see the the color difference um, but that may not be a terrible thing, especially when it comes to Tipex. So, you know, we'll soon see. Um, but in terms of, like, you know, paper, 
I mean, this is still very thin. Maybe a little bit thinner. I don't know. I think they're very, very close. So, on to the next section. So, this is obviously set up a little bit differently. So, here you have in the Hobonichi, this is sort of like your year at a glance um, kind of tracker calendar. Um, but in the Kinbo Dupe, okay, you have... Um, four months to two pages and you've obviously got the uh, days there and then you've got like this section at the bottom which blank section um which you could obviously put things like you know milestones um achievements important dates you know whatever you're basically going to be using this planner for and then you've got the next four months and the next four months there so that is you know that's obviously a slight diff well a, quite a big difference but not necessarily a bad one and as well you sorry i forgot to say you also have this thing this section at the top as well so again what you want to achieve and did you achieve it that's you know maybe something that i could do as this is my going to be my weight loss planner and then we go into the months so of course we've got january um now this obviously starts in december um because this is actually a 2021 throw um to obviously to the end of 2022 where this is just a purely a 2022 planner um so you've got january february march let's keep going november um December so yeah you have your 12 months in here where of course you know you have December but then it does give you January uh, February and March in the Hobonichi but what you do have in here is like a forward um, planner or this is actually called yearly plan that's what it has at the top there but you could use this as forward planning for 2023 if you really wanted to um, and you've got some great spaces here some blank spaces you've got January through to December so yeah I think this is a real nice like functional page if you can you know use it and I think it's a real nice functional page to have couple of pages to have in there and then these two um grid pages here which says a uh, plan of a new year at the top so that is that this is what you've mostly all been waiting for is the weekly so this is how the weekly layout looks let me just grab um a blank one from Hobonichi. So this is how the Hobonichi one looks. Kimball. I mean, if that's not a good dupe, I don't know what is. <laughs> this is just absolutely fantastic. So if we just have a look at this page, just kind of see this. Really, the only difference is that you haven't got this at the bottom of this one, which, in my opinion, isn't really such a loss. I mean, don't get me wrong, you know, if you, when it comes to kits, yes, we can actually kind of tell um, what the difference is just by here. So I've kind of got that lined up a bit there. Your, your Home and Ichi Week kits will not fit in here because of the date covers um in regards to the date covers sorry i should say the date covers they are um oh because obviously because you don't have this on here it uses you know it goes all the way down to the bottom it is therefore longer so that is really in my opinion really the only kind of difference there the only other difference is is that there are the these boxes are a one um row of grid bigger so there's actually seven square seven grid squares in here and there's only six in the hobonichi again not a massive change in my opinion and then this is how the other side of the page looks 
again a fantastic dupe completely the same you know bar this you gain more space which i think you know isn't necessarily a bad thing it's not a bad thing in my opinion uh so yeah and you've also got on here um some like little symbols of like water fruit uh i would gonna assume that's exercise and looks like toilet roll i mean how 2020 went with the whole loo roll fiasco you might want to track your loo roll <laughs> Because let's be honest, we're not at the woodworks with that yet, are we? So, um, yeah, fantastic. It's exactly the same. And if anything, you gain more space. Uh, let's carry on through then. Um, so, you, of course, have all your mumps. And you have up until... Yep, so you have um, all the way to the 1st of January... And then you have like this index page here um, and it just says page title and date. I mean, you can use that for whatever you want. Um, let's have a little look-see here. Uh, these are like, so this would basically be um, the comparison. So in my opinion, you know, I don't know quite know what I would use this for. But at the end of the day, I mean, it's so faint. You could, you know, you change, you just put some washi over that and just use it as notes if you really wanted to. But all I'd say is it's a hell of a lot more functional than this, in my opinion. Um, and then you've just got, I believe, this is all grid pages. And it just seems to go on and on and on. So that is the last grid page. Let's have a look here. Obviously, I have I've only got the standard Hobonichi. I haven't got the mega. Okay, and then um on to here. So you have like this really weird measuring <laughs> um, page in the Hobonichi. Very odd. <laughs> um but in here, you have a schedule. So if you kind of have like a set schedule for like the week, you could put that in there. As well as you have an annual target um, section. You kind of got like this page again. You just cover that up and use it for whatever you want, really. In the Hobonid, you kind of got like this, like My 100. And then you've just got all of these pages in Chinese, Japanese, I don't know what's the difference. I'm being a bit naive to that. Um, but what you have got in the Kimball, okay, is this 21-day plan. Um, and, yes, yeah, so you've got, which, again, a bit weird that it's set up like this. This is the only thing. This is very strange because one starts here uh, and you've got 9, 10, which, you know, I mean... Obviously, we I would prefer it had been one, but at the end of the day, not a big deal. It's so small and tiny, you could change that to to your to your day one, you know. Um, and you then just got this sort of box down here. You've then got your favourites uh, of. So if I bring this a bit closer, your favourites of like book, film, music, and. I have no clue what that is. If you do know, do let me know. Um, and then you could obviously give it a rating, write all of that in there. So you've got two, like four pages of that. And then you have the social relationship page with a present. So this could be, this could be like your birthday throughout the year, what you've got, you know, gonna get what you're gonna get all of that obviously for me that's not going to be used because this is for a weight loss journey um and then you have this kind of random page of oh okay it's an encyclopedia and this gives you measurements i'm going to show you this is paper some measurements of and like showing you the different paper sizes uh, and whatnot, but all of this I have no clue at all. <laughs> um, and then you've got a map. Uh, my it says my Chinese map at the top. 
Um, so you've got a map of China there. And then you've got, of course, can't read any of that. Then you've got just, again, just some, to me, kind of pointless uh, pages. But obviously some not. I mean, if you can read Chinese, then it's fantastic. Uh, I can't, unfortunately. Um, and then uh, just at the back here, you've got personal information, which is good. Kind of like a similar thing here. Personal information there. And then you've got the um, Kimball Weekly 2022 Life Document um, stamp just there. Uh, that is the back with a little pocket there and then that is the back of the planner so i think that this uh for what i'm going to use it for is going to be um fantastic and i truly do think that um if you're someone that doesn't use hobonichi weeks kits and you use your hobonichi as a real just functional planner yes you know, we all love Hobonichi and I've, you know, I've just recently discovered Hobonichi and this is a fantastic alternative, a fantastic dupe, in my opinion, of a Hobonichi. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and pop this into this cover and let's see how the fit on this is. Of course, you know... Let's have a little look see now the the cover is very i mean in like the cover on the book is very very soft and flimsy um so i am kind of thinking oh god putting it in but it's sliding in don't want to I don't want to uh, bend it to I don't want to crease the cover I'll try this way a second seems like just by looking at closely up at it while i'm trying to put it in it's like the cover is um kind of like felt basically so even though yet yeah, it's very very soft you know it it is uh like a felt cover just wanted to kind of point that out um with, with the hobonichi it's the hobonichi like that I mean, the Hobonichi is a. Oh, I'm not. Uh, I'm not trying to sound thing like I know it's a form of material, but it's not. It's not card or like any or plastic or anything like that. This is more like a foam, like a like a real um, durable foam. Again, obviously, like that's very easy to put into my cover um where this is more like a felt like the in like the inside as you can see here it's like felt i will put up on the screen how much this was it wasn't dear at all and as i say if i can find the link I will put the link down in the description box. But they had loads of um, loads of like different colours. And shipping wasn't too bad as well. It actually came quite quickly, considering uh, and on time. It's you know it's tracked. I think they they do that automatically. Um, I don't think I opted for tracking. Okay, we're getting there. Okay. No, we're not quite there yet. We're not quite there yet. Nearly there. 
And I'm trying to be a little bit more delicate with it. Because I don't want to rip the planner. Okay. I would say we are in. We are in. And there we go. So, there we have it, guys. That is my little find on AliExpress. Uh, Hobonichi Weeks dupe. And a nice just little clear cover there, which wasn't very dear as well. I think it was about £3. Um, so again, I will leave a link to uh, that as well down in the description. So that is it from me today. Thank you ever so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, if you give it a big thumbs up, you know it means the absolute world to me when you do. I cannot wait to set this up. I mostly will set this up off camera and come on uh, camera and show you how I've set it up. Just kind of the pressures that I, you know, I can never make my mind up on things. So thank you for watching. So I hope you're having a great day and a great week. And I shall see you all soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>